Hello everyone, and I'm back in my room in Cambridge. I'm so excited about it, honestly. I've missed being in Cambridge so much. I had a good holiday, but it is good to be back. So basically, today is Sunday, and my lectures don't start until Friday. Although I do have a couple of supervisions next week, the small group teaching sessions that I go on about the whole time, and they're on Wednesday and Thursday. But essentially work doesn't properly kick off until Friday. So that gives me just under a week to kind of get myself organised, get myself sorted. I've got a lot of stuff from last term that I still want to tie up in this week, so that's all solidified. And there's quite a few bits of editing and YouTube stuff that I want to get sorted before term gets hectic. I've got to do some laundry because I've just come back from boat club camp, so I've got to empty my suitcase, shove everything in the wash. Basically, this week is going to be a mix of working and getting organised but also having fun and a bit of partying because it's essentially refreshers week at the moment. This is a new thing this year for the college. They don't normally do this. At the start of first term, it's freshers week and at the start of second term, it's refreshers week. Basically, there's a few events organized and I'm planning on going out clubbing maybe once or twice and just having a bit of fun with my friends this week before we all get really busy during term. So I definitely want to make time for socializing this week as well. So the plan is work through the days, have fun in the evenings. We'll see how it goes. I've got a big to-do list. I can't really afford to be messing around in these next few days. Like to fit everything in, I need to be on it. I've got confidence in myself, to be honest. I work well under pressure, so. First thing on the agenda is to get my laundry done and then it's brunch. The first brunch of term in Jesus cafeteria. And I'm going with all my friends. Almost all of the staircase are back now. We're only missing Tim and Ella, who I believe are arriving back today. And look at that. My washing is done. Okay, I'm gonna tumble dry some of that, put some away in here to hang up. Let's get going. I'm in the queue for brunch. Everyone has been reunited and I'm so, so hungry. So I hope the queue goes quickly. Back to Sainsbury's, how I've missed this place, doing my shop. Sadly, my parents aren't here this time to pay for my first shop of term. I'm not paying for the shop, I'm just I'm with Astrid. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> Me and Astrid are gonna have fun. So let's get going. Okay, the shop has been completed. I have my bits. It cost a lot. I'm quite sad my parents weren't here, but hey ho, that's the big shop of term done. We've got food, we've got all the essentials. It's good. Okay, so I'm back from the shops. I've unpacked all my shopping in the fridge and I finished my laundry as well. Look at that all hung up. I am such a responsible adult. 20 years old now, you know, 20 years old. It was my birthday over the Christmas holiday, and so I'm no longer a teenager now, and it's kind of scaring me, to be honest, but also I feel like I've got to that point in my life where I've just got to be responsible and... Yeah. It feels like my birthday and Christmas were so long ago now, but actually they were only a few weeks ago. But now I'm back at uni and it's like... back to it. I've got a bit of Christmas chocolate to get me through. I've got so much chocolate guys. I don't even know how I'm gonna eat it this term, but there's a big stash because apparently my family goes very big on chocolate at Christmas. It's, it's really unhealthy. So we're just gonna pace myself with that. I'm being even more responsible right now and doing my spending spreadsheet. So I'm logging my Sainsbury's shopping. God, that was a pricey shop, I must say. And oh, it's one o'clock. And what time did I tell myself I'd start with my physics work? One o'clock, so. I better get going. Okay, so it may now be about 1.45 and no, I haven't started my physics yet, but to be fair, it's because I got distracted looking into internship opportunities for next summer, which is something useful to be doing anyway. And it's also on my to-do list for today. So, you know, we just did a bit of shuffling around. I'm thinking hard about what I want to apply for for the summer, because I really do want to have a summer internship and all the deadlines are fast approaching now. So really I want to get all my internship applications sorted 
this week. So that's what I'm going to do again later, finish writing up my CV and making sure it's all put together. But for now I'm going to get on with the physics because that's quite important. And then I'm also meeting someone in the Roost Cafe at 3 for a quick chat about coxing commitments this term. I don't want to do too much coxing this term. Obviously I'm really into it. I had an amazing time on the boat club camp and at this point, yes, I am like, woo, I love coxing, I love rowing, I'm gonna cox all day, every day. But actually that's not realistic. And to be honest, two or three outings a week is more than enough for me. And I need to keep on top of all my other work. So I've got to go discuss that and make sure that's all cool but they, they already know the commitment issue with me so yeah just organizing when my outings will be and yeah so gotta go discuss that quickly in the roost hopefully i won't get too distracted and hang around there too long but who knows <laughs> Loads of people are moving into college today, so like everywhere you go, there's a student and their parents carrying all their stuff and boxes in. It's really funny, like it's everywhere. Everyone's moving their stuff in for term. Oh, it's all starting up again. I've just come back from the roost and now I'm heading back to do some more work. I've just heard Ella's just got back, so I'm gonna go say hi. Okay, so we have a full staircase now. Ella just got back. It's all very nice. Yeah, we're going to go to CAF for dinner shortly, as per, and hopefully everyone will go together and it'll be great. Reunion dinner, you know. Then I'm going to a social with the Coxes. Then I'm going back to the staircase for pre's and then we're going to go out clubbing. Okay, so I've put some makeup on my face for like the first time in over a week and I'm just about to head off to the Cox's social. I'm currently still in my jumper, but I'll get changed afterwards for going out. So yeah, let's head across college. Uh, okay, I've just come back uh, to my staircase and I've got a late birthday present from people here. Firstly, Vinegar Girl, the book, because clearly I am Vinegar Girl. If you didn't know, I like vinegar a lot. I eat an unnecessary amount of vinegar. Then I got a massive bottle of sauce and small vinegar, which is always going to go down well with me. But then wait for it. I think the most exciting thing is extra strong sauce and small vinegar. All is happening in my gym. I have a mixture of pink lemonade and vodka, so it's a very pretty drink. Yeah, is that not in the episode? And we're playing Never Have I Ever. How exciting, Paige. <laughs> See? Ever Everyone's seen. excited. Never Have I Ever. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. We're about to walk to the club. It's very cold at this time of year, so I'm like kind of dreading it. But I've got a long sleeve top on, so hopefully that will keep me warm. Right now we're waiting for Ed, who is late as always. He's never on time. <laughs> late, late, Hello. and we're gonna go to the club. So fun times! Woo! We're really early. Well, yeah, we're gonna get the party started. started. It's fine. Like we might be early. As yeah. always, it seems the club is empty. But it's because we got here early, so we could skip the queues. We didn't have tickets. But it'll be a fun night. It will get busy. morning everyone so I'm up this morning and I've got a load of physics work to do for my physics A module my physics B module I've essentially done all the work I need to do before term starts so now just physics A to sort out today hopefully and I've got a meeting with my director of studies as well today I suppose just to discuss the term ahead 
so that'll be fun. I wasn't out too late last night, like, it wasn't the best night out. I left very early. I just wasn't feeling it, to be honest. But I got a still a decent night's sleep because I left fairly early, so all is good. Nanomex. I'm back to my nachos. Life is really good right now. Hello everyone. So I'm back in my room. I'm back at my desk and getting some more work done. Had a great trip to Nanomex. The food was so good. More physics questions to do now. Look, I've been essay writing. I'm a scientist, but I'm writing essays. What is this? My hand hurts. <laughs> I'm not used to this, but apparently our physics exam papers like us to write mini essays. But I mean, I get away with adding diagrams in as well, so it's fine. I've also done a bit more work on my CV this afternoon, so I think that's pretty much finished now. So I can send that off with my internship applications. I had a meeting with my director of studies. And I spoke to him briefly about the internships I'm thinking of applying for so that he can be prepped to write my references. So that's good. So yeah, I'm feeling, I'm feeling organized. I've got everything in my diary. I've been making notes of rowing outings because oh my god I'm up early Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday this week tomorrow morning we've got to rig up the boats because the boats have just arrived back on the trailer from boat club camp in Spain last week so I've got to go help and put the riggers on again tomorrow morning and then Wednesday Thursday Friday I'm going to be coxing outings with lots of the women's side who want to row this term that means I've got to be sensible and it turns out I'm not going to be partying as much as I thought this week no, no. Honestly, I do not want to be going to bed really late and getting up at the crack of dawn in the morning. It's just not fun. And I need to be starting term with a good bank of sleep. I can't be sleep deprived at the start of term because imagine what I'm going to be like at the end of term. I think I'm not going to actually go out much this week, but that's fine. Like, I was getting a bit bored of going out anyway. Like, going out's fun, but also... I can have fun during the day with my friends and then go to bed at a reasonable hour. I'm perfectly happy with my situation. Yeah, I'm gonna go get food. This is a rare sighting of Will cooking. <laughs> oh you my need God. kind of Will cooks. <laughs> Starring Will. <laughs> what do we think, guys? Is he doing well? We've had to help him along. Okay. Can you see how much is spitting? <laughs> There's yeah, so yeah, much oil in it. Yeah, it's yeah, just no. spitting halfway across the room. <laughs> mm. What are you making? I'm making uh, chicken and <laughs> rice. Ooh, yummy. Everyone's going to see real good. Hello. <laughs> I may have over oil this. As you can see, it's a busy kitchen this evening. Lots of people cooking. I'm just making a sandwich because it's all I can do, let's face it. Everyone oh, eating, isn't this nice? All eating different meals. It's All eating different meals. Oh. <laughs> ah. That's pretty. Hello. Are you pleased with yourself? I actually am. Mm. Chicken and a mess. So there's been some, there's been something going on in the staircase. I'll just pass you over to Astrid to explain. Right, guys. Here's how the story goes. Domino's pizzas, a couple of little garlic and herb no. sauces. Sorry. Excellent. No one wants the garlic and herb sauce. Good news for me. I take them all Three. back from the meeting, put them in my fridge. Three garlic and herb sauces. Last night, as part of my dinner, I toasted two slices of bread, a bit like pizza crust, had them in the garlic and herb sauces, two garlic and herb sauces. And I was like, mm, I'll save the other one for tomorrow. That'll be nice as a treat after my long day at Kusu Council. And so I came back ready for my garlic and herb sauce and opened the fridge. Alas, it was not there. There was a thief on the loose. It's milk gates all over again. Call the cops. Oh, who is it? Who is it? Who is it? Someone else. Just be quiet. <laughs> I can't believe this sort of stuff is going on in this staircase. I thought Unbelievable. Okay, so I'm just about to go to bed. I've got a fair amount of work done this evening. 
I went and played a few games with my friends just then and yeah now it's bedtime because I've got to get up tomorrow morning to rig boats I've got to be at the boathouse for 7 30. I've been thinking and I reckon I'm going to apply for an actuarial internship in the summer rather than a physics research internship although I say that now and actually I'm still not sure I'm going backwards and forwards I think I'm going to apply for both see if I can get anything like I know they're so competitive so I don't know how these applications are going to go down but like you've got to apply to be in with a chance haven't you so I'm obviously going to try applying so fingers crossed there and that's the end of this vlog. Thank you very much for watching. Please do give the video a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to see more videos from me, more vlogs coming soon, and I'll see you soon with another video. Bye!